If you guys don't know, Low Tier God, he is a streamer, YouTuber, uh, that recently got kicked off of YouTube for ban evading because he was basically streaming on a separate account and he already had a strike on his main account. YouTube found out about that and they uh, they banned his ass. He's gone. He got wiped off the face of the map. And ever since Low Tier God got banned, he has been trying to recover that YouTube channel. He's been trying to go out, stream on separate Twitter sources or separate sources, I should say, like this new website called Trovo, which he went to originally to start his new streaming situation. And now I think he is actually ban evading again, but on YouTube using a very odd method. So if you go to Low Tier God's Twitter as of recently, you can see that there is a video on his Twitter page, which is basically him discussing the Kai Sinat situation. Now, if you see this very closely, it's actually uploaded to YouTube and he actually retweets an account that is called the Covenant Brand. Now, if you go to the Covenant Brand, you can see that this is sort of just like a, a like a, a low tier god community based channel and the covenant as you all should know is what he considers his community you know the men in the cloaks so of course if you go to the actual youtube channel you can see that there is an overwhelming amount of subscribers for this new channel that's just been talked about and there's only one video so far which is a 41 minute 44 second video of the Kai Sinat situation where low tier God goes over in detail what he thinks about the Kai Sinat situation and he basically just breaks it down it's what he's always done with his content on YouTube except he does not show his face and this is a reoccurring thing that is going on in this YouTube channel here if you go over to the live tab you can see even the thumbnails he doesn't show his face the covenant you know, is a question arc, a man in the cloak. It could also stand for the group that he is a part of, which is the covenant, the covenant, you know, men wrapped up in cloaks. But it's a long period of just live streams with his voice, with everything going on in it. It seems like it's just a live stream of him going through here, but of course, not showing his face and for very, very obvious reasons. So if you actually go to Trovo and if you look up his actual Trovo uh, account, you cannot find it. It's not here. There are a lot of fakes. This is a fake account. This is not his original. So I would assume that either he got banned on Trovo or that he has been shadow banned or he even muted his own account so that he could try and continue his streams over on the Covenant. A lot of people in his comment section for his, uh, you know, his YouTube videos and his streams have been pointing out, you know, they've been saying, starting to think that this Covenant guy is just LTG in disguise. A lot of people are starting to come to the conclusion that this is legit just LTG on a whole new channel. People know that this is not, you know, just some random YouTube channel that came out of nowhere and the growth shows that as well. This channel, The Covenant, has started gaining a lot of subscribers over a very quick period of time. It had 5.5k subscribers beforehand, which makes me think that this is another person's account. And this is what a lot of people point to inside of Low Tier God's comment section. People inside Low Tier God's comment section are basically basically saying that someone else owns this account that is not low tier God that owns this account. His uploaded content is just being added to the actual account here. And it seems like this could be true because we haven't seen low tier God's face. And this account has existed previously unless low tier God had any, uh, true reasons, uh, to have a, a separate brand account before, which has never been known to my eyes or anyone else's eyes. And of course, it would make more sense too, because I don't know if this is the official guy that did it, but there's this guy named Christopher Soso, which randomly makes a post and low tier God retweets it. This could be the owner, or again, it could be a fan. But regardless, low tier God and this Covenant brand channel are related in a lot closer of a way than you may think. So I'm interested to see where this goes. I don't know how far this falls in the ban evasion sense, but I've been hearing that Keemstar, you know, Drama Alert, has done a similar thing in the past and still has gotten banned. So if YouTube is able to find out if this account is legitimately low tier God's content and it's him and he's planning to do all of this in the background, I could see that this account would be banned in the near future and that, you know, low tier God again would have to pivot back to going to another website. And again, his Trovo account cannot be found if you search his name up. The only way you can find his Trovo account is if you go into an actual link that you had previously and look for it. And the account exists, but there hasn't been any activity on it as well. So it looks like maybe he's putting an end to his Trovo journeys for sure. But again, I would love to hear what you all think about this down in the comments below. Do y'all think that low tier God deserves a second chance on YouTube? Or do you think that he's trying 
trying to ban evade again or maybe this is just a fan uploading his content i would really love to know what you think about the situation down in the comments below man of course if you like these videos you want to see more make sure to hit that like and that subscribe button or aiming to push this channel high so any support will be appreciated but without further ado thank you all for watching and peace out